Hello, welcome to another Retro Review Roulette video from Retro Rubbish. This is the series where I use a random game generator to pick a random retro game that I'm not familiar with to play for around 15 minutes or so and review it on the fly. I'll point out the good, the bad, and the janky, and I'll give it an overall grade at the end. Alright, here we go. Hello and welcome back to another video. Uh, today we're looking at the Flintstones on the Sega Genesis. <laughs> I should uh, let you know, I don't know if I'm going to release the footage or anything, but I, uh, I actually um, <laughs> I actually f started filming a couple different videos. One for a game called Onslaught on the Sega Genesis. I have no idea what's happening. And there was another one, I don't remember what it was called even, it was some other kind of like old school fantasy game and it was some kind of weird strategy game uh, Valkyrie lady with wings and a spear and then there's another lady with almost no clothes on why are women always portrayed <laughs> with like no clothes on in these fantasy games like come on it's ridiculous oh boy oh I can't I can't just play this and then there was a, the next one that came up in my random list was Light Crusader. Light Crusader. Hell no. Which was another kind of weird isometric RPG or something. I just didn't get any of them. I didn't understand how to play them, especially Onslaught. That was... I don't even understand what was going on. That was so confusing. So I... I just hit random again and I came up with the Flintstones. This one I feel like I can figure out. So, so let's, let's, uh, let's give it a shot here. Okay, we're gonna start. Fred. So far the graphics look really good. They, uh, you know, I, I've always noticed the difference between Genesis graphics and Super Nintendo graphics. Generally, uh, Generally, the Genesis has more dithering, and uh, it just can't display as many colors on screen as this the Super NES. So, um, but this one really looks good. I don't see a lot of like the dithering kind of look that you see in a lot of Genesis games. This is fun. It's very responsive. So, I can't remember what the buttons are on the Genesis controller because I'm using a Logitech pad on, a, on my <laughs> emulator on a PC. Um, if I remember correctly, it was A, B, C? If that's correct, then the, the button on the right, which is, I think, C, is jump, and then the middle button is attack. And then the... Well, that's nice. The A button, the button on the left, is also jump. So if you... If you want, you could, uh... You know, you could kind of use a reverse configuration, which is kind of cool, because... I mean, most people like it a, a certain way. And then most people complain when the <laughs> when the buttons are reversed for jump and attack. Um, but this one seems really good. So so far it's fun. The graphics are good. It's kind of hard to grab the ledge. I don't quite understand how to grab the ledge. Oh, you hold the jump button. Okay. 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 I'm getting it now. This is fun so far, really. Oh, I like when he ducks. He just sticks his head into. <laughs> Into his shirt! <laughs> That's awesome! <laughs> oh boy, this is so much more fun than Onslaught and Light Crusader <laughs> and what's that other one? I don't remember what it's called. It was some kind of stupid fantasy game. It was like a the the game itself ended up oh it was like Master of Master of Monsters, maybe? But it was a it ended up being like a strategy game. Which I can't really judge those very well because I don't typically like them very much. Well, I'm bad at this. <laughs> yeah, I don't really like strategy games all that much. Um, and this one was one of those, like, the, you know, the world is in a grid. You see, like, a map of the world in a grid. And, yeah, I don't know. Just not, not my bag, so I didn't want to... I didn't want to give a bad review to a game that might actually be good in most people's eyes, so I'm going to try and stay away from those kinds of, of uh, 
Uh, those kind of strategy games. The only strategy game I've ever... Oh, what the hell? How do you... Do you just avoid the heads? Whoa, do I have six friends? Or is that... That must not be lives. Oh, you can hold down your attack and, like, do a super... Super smack. Okay, that's cool. Okay, so now that I know how to hold onto the ledges, it's a little bit easier, but it's still a little annoying because you kind of have to do it the exact right way. Like, if you come at it from the inside of the building going outwards, it doesn't really work, which, I mean, I guess that kind of makes sense anyway, but... Um, but yeah, that's okay. Whatever. It's all good. So I'm going to try... Just jumping, like, through... Okay, I can't touch him. Oh, how... So how the hell do I... Am I supposed to... Wait a minute. Oh, yeah, okay. Okay, so I gotta hit them. Ah! Okay, come on, buddy. Okay, I get it now. <laughs> okay. Okay, I'm gonna start fresh. Let's just start fresh. Start over. Start fresh. Um, I have to start at the start anyway. I always... I just don't see the point in continuing when you're on the first level. <laughs> it's not like I would have been put farther ahead. Yeah, take that, you jerk. That guy's hit me so many times. Okay. So even though I'm not good at this game yet, maybe I'll get better. It seems pretty forgiving. I feel like it could it could be one of those games where uh, you could have a lot of fun with it and you don't have to practice too, too much. It doesn't seem insanely hard yet, but we'll see. This is only the first level. It's kind of, it's weird, but when I swing my club at these guys, there's almost like a bit of a delay. God, if you just miss like, by like a pixel, it doesn't hit them. Ah! Okay, there we go. <laughs> I love that duck. That's so awesome. Those clouds. Holy crap, it's a windy day. <laughs> Ooh, must be a checkpoint. Whoa, he's running! Whoa! Whoa, that was cool. Okay, I'm on a shark. Yes. Just hammer on that attack button. Jump! Oh! Oh, you ball! Straight. That's weird. I'm owning it though. You ball. <laughs> okay. Okay, I'm just gonna. I know, I'm prepared now, Mr. Shark. Ha! I know. I know what's up. Oh! Oh boy! Okay. That was a little tough. Okay. I wish there would have been a checkpoint kind of after this part. Oh well, that's okay. No worries. This is a fun game. I do enjoy it. Oh man, I don't know... Oh! Oh no! I don't know if the... This is hard, actually, this part. I don't know if the uh, shark comes up at the exact same spots every time! Oh, oh, and I couldn't hold on to that ledge to get back up. Okay, that part sucks, actually. Well, I shouldn't say sucks. That part's challenging. <laughs> okay, I continued, but I had to start at the very start of the whole level. Okay, that kind of sucks. Oh, well, that's okay. We're just learning, right? Just learning, no problem. Oh, I gotta do that snake part again. <laughs> With the climbing up the snakes. Okay, let's give it another shot here. At least I know what to do. Ah! Ah! God! This part sucks! 
Again, I shouldn't say it sucks. <laughs> it's hard, like, Fred has this, like, a bit of a momentum going, so then when you jump on the snake, you can't turn around real fast to, to whack the, the other snake, the next snake. Um, so it just, it's kind of, it's harder than it looks. That's what I feel like. Oh, prick. <laughs> what the hell is that thing? Oh, man, seriously. Okay, I don't like how you can't j grab onto those ledges, because there's been a few times where I've uh, been holding the jump button, and I've been right against the ledge, and it just doesn't work. Oh, damn it. I tried to jump and hit him. I thought that'd be easier. Okay. I wonder if he... if I wonder if he comes up at the same spots all the time. Oh, okay, that... You can't avoid those stupid jumping fish and the shark at the same time. At least, it's really hard to. Okay, we're gonna... We're gonna try and keep the frustration level to a minimum here, but... <laughs> this part is a little challenging. Yeah, yeah, blow up the... Okay, it was a bit different that time. Oh! Oh, it is really hard to get those guys. Oh, oh, oh! <laughs> oh my goodness! Whew, that was tough. That was very stressful. Oh, what's this? An egg. Oh, it follows me now. Oh, maybe not. Oh, yeah, it follows me. Oh. Cool. I'm getting some slowdown here. I wonder if that uh, would be like that just on the Genesis, the real Genesis hardware, or if that's just an emulation thing. I don't have the best computer, but it should be more than enough to run any of these games. It's really hard. You, there's just sometimes. Oh, okay. You can grab onto the ledges. Oh, okay. But like, there's some spots where you can't really. Okay. Why didn't I grab that ledge? I was holding the jump button. Um. This is really hard. There's some places where there's just nothing to jump onto. Like, there's no ledge for me to get to there. So I have to, I guess, just wait till one gets low enough? Okay, well... Yes. 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 Yes! I did it! That's right! <gasps> oh no! Was that supposed to happen? Oh... Crap! Okay. Wow. Okay, so this game is not as easy as I first thought. <laughs> that part with the shark. The the part with those those uh, logs that you got to climb up. It's hard, but there's not a lot of danger of dying there. At least if you you know fall and fail a few times, it's not a big deal. Where's the stupid shark part? <laughs> Super easy to die. I wish that... Oh, balls. Oh, I gotta start again. You just reset. Come on. See, it doesn't, like, turn around very well. That's the problem. Okay. Okay, just a little practice there. Okay, now we get to the shark part again. This is going to be my final attempt. Because <laughs> I'm already over 12. Already over 13 minutes. Oh, come on, you stupid bastard. God. So my... My, uh... Strategy, I think, here is just going to be to dodge the fish. <gasps> 
That is frustrating. <laughs> okay, maybe I'll just avoid the items even because, <laughs> like, I feel like I'm getting hit mainly because. Oh, there I get hit all the time. Um, but I'm getting hit mainly because I'm, I'm trying to stop and get every item. No, oh, I'm just going for it, man. I don't care. Oh. Oh boy, I passed it. Okay, that's excellent news. <gasps> what? Why didn't I do that last time? Oh my god, and he shoots things. Oh, that's so cool. Oh boy, I don't like this. I'm gonna fall to my death. Watch. Oh. That was awesome! Okay, somehow I didn't know about that the first time. I even hit that egg with my my bat or whatever, my club, and it didn't do anything the first time. Oh boy. Oh! 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 <laughs> you okay? That guy was really fast. I couldn't get away from him. All right. Whoa. <laughs> you just never know what those guys are going to do. I'm actually kind of terrified. <laughs> I'm scared to fall. <gasps> oh! 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 Jeez! Okay, I had no idea that was going to happen. I guess you, this is going to be a matter of... Uh, oh, come on. Trial and error. Oh, I just want to make it through A-level. more sharks. Yes. Yes. <gasps> Did I pass it? Oh, there's a boss. Oh. Oh, okay. I lost my, my good dude. Oh. Oh no! Oh no! Okay. Maximum progression! Oh! Okay, okay, I get it. Sort of. It's gonna be tough though. Ah! I just can't get him. Oh shoot! Oh, oh I, I come back. Yes. Respawn, baby. Yeah, take that, you piece of shit. <laughs> yeah, eat my club. I will power club you. Oh, yeah, power club. Okay, I think what I'm going to do... Okay. I'm going to wait till he, like, does that. And I'm going to power club him. Yes! Take that, you stupid son of a bastard. <laughs> Look at that derby lizard. <laughs> I love it. Oh, he's surrendering. What do I do now? Do I smack him again? <laughs> Kick him while he's down? Oh, I just have to get the item. Okay. <laughs> well, my... Okay. Oh, I got her necklace. Aren't I sweet? Whoa, I'm already like over 18 minutes here. I wasn't expecting to get past that. Whoa! Water level! Oh, look at that. That's cool. Oops. So how do I... How do I get up higher there? Okay. Oh, I can keep tapping. <laughs> God. Oh my goodness. Yeah, just keep tapping. You know, it's a freaking water level. Like, what did I expect? Oh, and impaled on the spikes. Take that, you jerk. 
eat club. Sorry, you eat club too. <laughs> ah, the classic water level. Oh boy. Oh, what the hell? Okay. The lights went out and then I died. <laughs> okay. You know, despite a few little... Oh, I see those things like... It's like a fan that blows you into the spikes. Yeah, despite a few little issues here and there with this game, it's pretty good. It's pretty fun, really. Okay. Oh boy, okay, this time I'm not going down to the bottom. Oh, oh boy! Take that. Power up. I don't know what that means. Son of a... Okay. <laughs> okay, that's where I'm going to quit. Um, so this game... Yeah, this is already going late. Um, okay, so here's what I think. This game is really fun. Um, despite initially thinking that it would probably be kind of easy, um, it's not like it was insanely hard. It wasn't Castlevania or Ninja Gaiden or anything like that. Um... But it did have some challenging moments, and I'm sure that would continue on for the rest of the game. Uh, but the most important thing was, it was pretty fun. Uh, so once you get to learn some of these nuances, like these fans, octopus fans, and not to go, you know, too close to these spikes, you know, things like that, I think you're, you're going to have a good time with this game. So based on what I've seen, I'm going to give this game four derpy lizard bosses out of five. Yep, four derpy lizard bosses out of five. Thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next one. Bye.